Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. This is a special love tarot reading session for you Aries. Let us see what's happening towards you. What is the message for Aries? Please in love, relationship, dating, getting to know. This is a special love message, weekly love reading for the Aries sign, okay? Before I start, Aries, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe, okay? This reading is for you. Thank you, Aries, for coming back. Thank you for supporting the channel. And if you would like to further connect with me, Aries, um, all you have to do is to visit the description box below. You would see the details of the, you know, the website. I'd love for you guys to subscribe in our mailing list and newsletter. We send out, you know, astrology, uh, bonus reading, full moon and new moon um, write-ups. So if you're interested to receive that, please be part of our mailing list, okay? And of course, the setting intention candle. Uh, this is free shipping worldwide. It comes with a free birth chart reading and the 2022 uh, numerology and the 2022 plan by stars, the, in, the, the major transit to note for the year 2022, most especially you. There's a lot of eclipses happening to your sign. So if you want to know, if you want to get that for free, it comes, uh, you know, get these setting intention candles. Okay, let's start your reading. What is the love message for you? What can I get for Aries? Love message. Okay, you've got the world card. Okay, let's look at your situation in here. You've got the world card. You've got the knight of cups and the star card in reverse. Hmm. It seems to be, Aries, you have lost or you have given up or withdrawn you know, to a special person, you know, I feel a bit sad that I feel like it's you who gave up in this reading because there's so much love coming from the external energy, the Knight of Cups. Um, the person, I feel like you're sad that you gave up and, and so was the person, you know, like, there's so much to look forward, but somehow things got shortened and something tells me that, you know, your person would like to get to know you, uh, to spend more time with you, to be with you. They would like to complete the cycle of the getting to know or dating or maybe reconciliation. They still would like to be part of your life. It's possible that you block this person or maybe you're ignoring them right now. But your person in the next couple of days and weeks, you know, this is valid for a one, this is valid for a month. Um, they hold the cup. Look at that, the Knight of Cups. You know, they hold the cup and they are waiting and hoping that you would, you know, you would be okay. You would you would connect. That you would that you guys will catch up. You know, even as friends. You know, they're quite desperate. The yeah, the, the star card is in reverse. Your person is quite desperate. Even as a friend, you know, they will, you know, they wish that you, that you would be okay. Even as a friend, if, if the lover's energy or the romantic energy, it's not yet ready between the two of you, then they wish that you did not block them or they wish that, you know, things like the days or the weeks would speed up and you guys would connect you know they they fear that they've lost you whoever this person is two of pentacles you know um they carry with them all of the memories this looks like you know they juggle all of the memories and you know there's so much page of ones the longer you guys do not talk the longer you guys do not communicate the more this person you know ace of wands really wish that they could you know, you know show you the ace of wands like there's a lot of i'd say feeling and thinking that they've lost you uh there's a knight of cups in here the knight of cups one of the sincerest knight sorry sincerest energy in the deck i feel like this person you know they really want like they wish that they could have shown you the they really wish that they could have explore or they have 
spend more time with you and you know make you feel the ace of wands there's so much wanting to prove to you that we could have try a bit more you know something to do which we, sh we should have not surrender okay yeah five of pentacles this is abandonment this is one thing to go back connect and reconnect yeah they really want to connect or reconnect but they're feeling a bit you know they are they are sitting in an energy of regrets and like losing hope like when they think of you it's kind of they feel like there's there's nothing that you're no longer interested because of the amount of time that you were not talking or maybe there's something that you exchange verbally there's some sort of messages that you have exchanged verbally with this person they they take it really seriously like if you really said breakup or stuff like they they're quite sensitive you know you're dealing with a person who take it so deep and serious what you say or whatever is happening to you and this person they're still in that gloomy and sad a bit dramatic you know there's there's they're, they're a bit sensitive and emotional and sad of course king of swords they still care about you yeah queen of pentacles two of swords absolutely this person you might you might I'm really getting like you might find this person king of cups in reverse you might find this person immature or maybe there is inconsistency in their action but one thing is for sure that this person in real life or in like this person if you if you get to know them or they might be immature or a little bit insensitive or a little bit dramatic as a lover as a lover you know they're as a lover they have flaw but if you look at them as a person you know they're really genuinely kind if if you know i'm 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 getting a very soft soft spoken or a very gentle but immature a little bit guarded kind of person like in in this reading you're definitely the alpha yeah they really really like you they've learned so much from you look at that the hermit card and your connection they want more but they're quite weak you know that like this person is soft and weak to really come up there and hey aries do you want a second round do you want to try it? something with this person that they're scared you know they escape chariot card um, I feel like this person is still building their courage to match your energy. They like you, your personality. They like what you've been through in life. They, You inspire them. There's something with you that this person is falling in love. You know, Knight of Cups. But it got interrupted. Okay. Tower card in reverse. King of Wands. Yeah, they want more. The Nine of Pentacles. The Four of Wands. They really want more of you. They really wish that you could, if things are not ready between the two of you to be romantic, they wish, they really wish that you would, you and them would be friends. They really wish that you did not block them or something to do with, they wish that there would be a time that you could have at least a comfortable, not awkward conversation. There is a high priestess in reverse. They're manifesting an energy on how to connect on how to be more confident because i feel like this person probably run away or avoiding you avoiding you not they're avoiding you not because they don't want to talk about they don't want to talk about you but there's something about not confident they're a bit fright fear or intimidated it's something of that energy that they're quite sitting to be okay not yet i'm not ready i'm nervous okay i want to high priestess i want to manifest confident i want to manifest the right timing i want to manifest the right confident and energy to come and face aries like you're you're their greatest fear i don't know what you do with this person but they're quite um they're they, they find you very interesting and at the same time challenging but sexy 
you know it's it's a person who's trying to combat if this is a dating or getting to know this person is trying to really combat their insecurity they find you interesting they find themselves really shy and quiet to you and um but but they're manifesting the right attitude the right you know swag to come up to you and show you that aries yeah it's my fault yeah let's talk or aries can it take you out something to do with a bit alpha personality like they really want to impress you like they come they want to they want to come forward to you in a very confident um a very very confident um energy aries i yeah you guys are a match in terms of like one is yin one is yang so I feel like this this energy would still develop. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. I can assure you, Aries, if you give it time, you and your person, you would be able to really learn how to get to know. Like, if if things, if you will be given a second chance, which is really, really, there's a huge potential that you've got a second round, second chance, this person will be able to counter you and show you how confident they are. And it would be so much fun to have you and them to like to have each other around like this is a situation where your situation could be like a funny romantic combination it this will develop you know maybe days or weeks or months would pass by but that would be an advantage because the the confident on how to handle each other would grow like there's some sort of learning okay aries and i break up or not talking or separated but it would grow they will learn how to handle your you and you will also learn like this is okay where did where is the weak spot that's the vibe i'm getting with you and your person and um so yes this is your this is your reading this is the love message for you thank you aries and um it's really a pleasure doing the reading to you guys please don't forget to connect with me all of the details down in the description box below please don't forget to check this out aries and wherever you are take care and i'll see you soon again guys you have a great day bye bye